Well, in Top Topic, we take a look at one of the stories making headlines here in China over the past 24 hours. And today's topic deals with a very expensive tradition that seems to be taking place during the Dragon Boat Festival. Now, a report from One China Times has stated that the Imperial Palace Food Company in the capital city of Beijing has launched a Zongzi gift box for the price of almost 1,900 renminbi in order to celebrate the Dragon Boat Festival, which has reportedly been authorized by the Palace Museum, which it ministers the former imperial palace in the capital of the country. Now, although the box is called the Zongzi gift box, Zongzi being a glutinous rice ball wrapped and steamed in a bamboo leaf, other treats are also included, such as cakes and tea. Now, the Palace Museum did not give the company the right to display its seal of approval on the box itself. Now, this is coming to us from the Economic Weekly, quoting one museum employee who has only been identified as Lee. Meanwhile, a salesman from the company said that the authorization of the seal had expired this year based on the agreement signed by the museum and the company back in 2002. The local media has also reported that the company's Zongzi products sold for as much as 1,780 renminbi last year. So this is quite a bit of money that is being put down for some snacks. Well, we actually took a poll asking people what they think about this uh, about this pricey food. And 24% um, of the people polled seem to be asking the question, why has the Palace Museum become a money-creating machine? And they're basically talking about how the Palace Museum seems to be catering to the wealthy in the country. 37% of the people polled are saying that these songs are gifts that will be sent to officials. How ironic. And 39% of the people polled are, are saying, I wonder what will happen happen after people eat this expensive songsa. Well, next up on Media Watch, we take a look at the name in the news.